wanted to begin by asking you, the film really dissects the artistic value of words versus pictures. What was it about that theme as a filmmaker that you really wanted to explore with this movie? Uh, I guess it's because I'm a filmmaker, which is the most important. You know, in, in film you sometimes use words to drag people unknowingly from one scene to another. Sometimes you do the opposite. You allow a scene to flow over into another using the words as a transition. Other times it's, it's, it's the pictures. Um, you know, in this film there's a very dramatic moment where Clive disappoints Juliet and you see her upset and you see him absolutely uh, wishing he'd never done this. Uh, and if you just hold it in the one shot and see both at once, you don't need the words, right? But we, use, we actually use the words, but you don't need them. So, so some t uh, most of uh, the scenes where Juliet is struggling with her art, there are no words. It's just what's going on on her face, you know. A couple of times when Clive is searching for words to write, it's no words spoken, you know, just on his face. Um, so each each has a power at a certain time, and it's just worth looking at what that is. Um, and in a way, kind of words are more interactive and I mean public, uh, whereas pictures are kind of private. You know, there are an individual's response to something. And then there's music. <laughs> yes, absolutely. <laughs> so it's really words and pictures and music and all kind of coming together to make a film, to make yeah. this type of art. And uh, you know, music in our films, um, I like when it tells you something that you can't be told in any other way, when it adds something to a scene that might tell you what you're looking at is not quite what's going on here. Uh, maybe this is a little sadder than you think or there's an agenda going on here you don't know about rather than saying this is what you're going to feel and this right. is funny. I hate that stuff. <laughs> well tell me about casting Clive Owen and Juliette Binoche, I mean two excellent actors. What was it about them that was really right for these roles? Well, apart from being a great actor, Juliette can paint. I wanted to ask you about the painting in this. So she's a real painter? Was that really her? Everything in the okay. film she paints. Okay. And uh, in fact, her she has to go on the same journey as her, as her character does for different reasons, obviously, but she's a portrait painter, as was the character in the film, and she had to find a way of expressing things differently, um, which was one big trick for the film. But the fact that she has such talent gave us that opportunity to really go exploring and be spontaneous, you know. And Clive, you know, he's a classically trained actor with a real love for words. I'd met him uh, along the way, around about the time of Gosford Park, and, you know, it was very clear that, um, that he had a great love of the language. And uh, he first thought when this came up was Clive Owen. Well, they're both really great in the movie. It was great talking to you. Big pleasure to meet you.